on YouTube, it's your boy Dan, aka Job. Pretty guys, the episode of our Pokemon Solar Light Lunar Zark Nuzlocke Let's Play, guys. If you missed the last one, you can always check it out in the description below. Be sure to hit that like button and subscribe. You guys are new, man. We're we're cruising along here. We're facing him, no puffs. So you know we got that going for us. Uh, let's go to Spectre this time around. But um, yeah, man, last episode was pretty wild, dude. We uh, worked our way through this cave. We ended up hatching uh, hatching a pretty sick egg. You can see kind of our newest member, the little. A little snack homie, so uh, hopefully he'll end up being pretty good, but let's go for a nice little shadow ball action here on this Hypno. Puff! He's definitely Psychic Poison, which is a cool, cool deal there. So level 40 for our snake. Here comes a Snoozy. I'm just going to continue to switch train my man Spyro here, just to get him caught up to the team. And he's actually almost there, like legitimately one episode, and he's like almost caught up to the team, which is pretty cool. What's up, Boobity? So, yeah, he's, he's actually like already pretty much caught up to the team in one episode. Which is, I mean, that's kind of sick, right? Like, it's good to know. I mean, I did Lucky Egg Switch train him the entire time. But other than that, like, it's good that he's doing that. So. All right, we knocked out the Snoozy. And I don't know what this next thing is, but again, I'm gonna keep doing what I'm doing here. It takes a little bit longer to do it, but it's worth a nap. Dude, it's a nap kit and it's still not evolved, man. Oh, I can't switch because of Shadow Tag. That's a little annoying. Okay, well, let's Flamethrower and hope for the best. This could actually be really bad. Flamethrower. Good damage there. Bro! How are you gonna do that to me? How are you gonna scare me like that? Jeez. How are you gonna scare me like that? I really thought he was going down for a second. I really thought I was going down for a second. That was a little, a little scary there. That was a little scary there, jeez. All right, we got an elixir. Okay. Hex is, gives it a boost, Bergy, if I was burned, not if they were burned, so it wouldn't have mattered. But what's up, Weepa, how's it going? Uh, so we have multi-scale, so we take less damage the first attack if we're at full health. So we're at full health, so the Hex didn't do that much, and then the second Hex actually did more, because we weren't at full health anymore. That's basically how that went down. All right, I'm so tired of these Razor Winds, dude. Why are you so fast, Cyril? Yo, yeah, Spectre's typing is so good though. Ghost normal, I like, I forget how good that is, man. Cause like, immune to fighting, normal, and ghost type moves, it's really clutch. That's actually really clutch. I should catch that thing. I know, we do need an encounter. That's definitely my favorite thing I've seen so far. Is that the end of the cave already? Small cave. Yeah, this dude, we keep seeing this guy. Oh, I can run this time though, good. Oh, there's a guy. If you win, could you show me the exit? Spectre has no weaknesses then? Uh, it's weak to dark, dude. Golemo! Yeah, we're switching. Um, we can go into... We'll go to Terra. Get that powerful mega evolution going. Brick break, I was predicted! Oh god. Actually, did a lot. But if I raise your leaf, it's not gonna matter. I feel like Terra's Mega Evolution could look a little cooler. Wow, how are you gonna live that, dude, on legit 1 HP? This is why we need a better move. Razor Leaf is so bad. We need something. All right, we beat him, though. Spyro to 41, and a Cosmet. I know, that invisible Focus Sash. And Cosmet again, and we'll just go into Terra again, because Terra's mega evolved and just, just real powerful, you know? Terra is, uh, it's crazy that our starter is still with us, man, after all this time. We've done a good job. Done a good job keeping him around. And he gets to mega evolve now, which is phenomenal. What a legend. All right, cool. I'm gonna just throw a potion on him just to be safe. Don't jinx it? Did I just jinx it, you think? Uh-oh, it's all downhill from here, guys. Right, let's grab that Pokeball. What is this? Oh, it's a little cloud, homie. A Nimblo. Uh, a little nervous, actually, about trying to run. I think I should switch. Let's just switch. I don't want to risk it for the biscuit, dude. Because if he has a water move, we're dead. Oh, I guess not really. Oh, wow. He goes for an electric move. Go figure. 
Hyper potion. Okay. Why do I feel like I should have gotten out of this cave by now? Whoa, it's a Cosmet. I got away. Oh, double battle coming up. Okay. Um, Pateri actually is solid here. Although, I think we're going to face off against some, um, some Psychic or Ghost type. So, I'm actually going to put Spectre in the front. Okay. All right, let's see what you got here. Hypnopuff and Cyril. And Spike and, you know, the homie. So, I kind of want to go and just stay in, but I know I should switch out. So, I'm going to switch out. I'll go to Pateri, and then I'll just go for a nice, powerful Shadow Ball and get rid of this dude. All right, that was easy. Good stuff there. And air Slash, so we switched. It was fine. Hey, what's up, Pirate? Nice, man. Here comes another Cyril. So we can just go for the um, the Lightning Strike and then the Shadow Ball, I guess. And that should knock out both of them, probably. Yeah. Not too bad. Pretty easy there. And Shadow Ball. See you later. All right, another level there. And here comes the Hypno Puff. Same deal, we'll just go for the Shadow Ball. And he just... The crits, dude, are so nice, man. Okay, cool. We can leave the tunnel? Oh, thank you. All right, so I think this is the end of the tunnel here. So I'm going to put someone else in the front so I can run. Let me just see if this is the end of the tunnel. It is. Okay, so we're in Green Pine. So I do get my encounter. I haven't encountered anything in this tunnel yet. So let's just snag our encounter real quick, and then we'll proceed. Yeah, I think this guy's cool, man. I don't know really what he is, but... uh. I think this will be the guy we catch, so let's snag him real quick. Um, let's go for an extra sensory and see if he lives it. If not, we'll snag the next one. You're bad. Okay. Next one. Let's see if we can catch it. We'll grab a Cyro. I mean, like I said, I don't necessarily... It seems like he's ghost. Ghost type, maybe ghost flying or something. So he's not exactly insanely good, but... Type-wise for what we need, but he may be useful. Just see if I can catch him. Okay, that was really effective. Razor wins. I don't know if you realize I'm a, uh, what you say, normal type. Um, is there a ghost type of me? Ghost flying. No, ghost flying, dude. Yeah, he does not want to be caught in the first try. Okay. So I am going to have to chip him down somehow, some way. So we can go into a uh, spike probably and just go for a poison jab. Because poison jab is resisted by ghost types. So hopefully it doesn't knock him out. Uh, and if it does knock him out, then he's really bad. He might be really bad. Oh my god, why are you so weak? You don't deserve to be on my team, dude. With defenses like that, that's absurd. How do I even catch you if you just die to one hit? Oh, I don't want this guy. I think the other guy's cooler. Not that I need another ghost, but... Alright, let's try this again, Cyril. Mr. I can't live a hit to save my life. I guess I have to do this the long way. And just hit you with the, uh... The leech seed and legitimately leech seed you down until I can catch you because that's how that's gonna go. Ridiculous. All right, I'll just keep leech seeding, taking a little bit of health back every turn, and eventually he'll be weak enough to where I could probably catch him. Bam! There it is. That worked out really well. All right, we need to figure out a nickname for this thing, and we want to learn Wood Hammer. Yes! It all makes sense now, dude. It all makes sense now. Ghost flying creates air currents deep in caves, giving the illusion of an exit nearby. Lost tigers follow these winds, only to end up more lost in the cavern. All right, let's name you. 
Cast? Wait, didn't we already have a Casper though? I feel like we already had a Casper. Y'all just always saying Casper. Gasper. There we go. That's the innovation I like to see. Chat, I like I like you guys, you know? I don't care what anyone says. You guys are great. Alright, we're gonna call him Gasper. <laughs> Trash bird? Now that's now we're getting there. Okay, Green Pond City, baby! Yeah, I feel like I've been headed towards Green Pond City for a really long time. Oh, this music sounds familiar, too. Hello, my name is Daisy. I'm a groomer. I can give your Pokemon a massage. Nope. I'm the name raider. Want me to rate the... No, I got the best nicknames. Gasper, bro. Did you not catch that? I named a Pokemon Gasper. Have you heard of Bailey? He loves nature and he spends a lot of time in the tropic jungle doing research. This is a big town. Jeez. It's like a nice little ranch area. Look kind of tough, but the gym is tougher unless you give your Pokemon the right items. Wait, I didn't mean to take that. Why does this always happen to me? Oh, can I buy all of them? No, light clay is good. I'll take the. Does he just give me all of them? Does he just keep giving me stuff? I didn't ever take the binding band though. Thanks, bro. I guess you can do like an infinite money thing where you just sell all the items he gives you over and over again. Not that that's worth it, but it's a thing that you could do. Oh, it's raining now, apparently. Oh, grass type is next. And he's gonna give me the meadow plate. Oh, I'm paying for it? He didn't tell me. I saw the price thing come up, but it didn't seem to indicate. Oh, this is like a little farmer's market? What do you guys all have? Oh, you could buy the HMs. Okay, Waterfall's kind of cool. Otherwise, the rest of them are kind of useless for my team, so. Megalofang is better, so it's not really that needed. Evolution Stones. Okay. That's good to know that you can buy these here. Uh, items that raise the stats with these calcium and stuff. Yeah, X items. Gems. Now this is cool. This is actually really clutch. Gems are good. Um, yeah, gems are good. Of course, there's no flying gem for acrobatics. What's up, Spear? Gems are actually kind of good. Oh, you have TMs. What do you have? Uh, I had a feeling that Reflect and Light Screen were going to be here. Because we just got the Light Clay. So that's kind of cool. And the Happiness Checker for Return. I like that. That's good. I just got an Airstone. I'm good. And Berries. Not good. Our, our team is actually good against Grass types. So that's actually a good thing. I like our chances against Grass types. Oh, you have Mist Tablet. Trick Room. Nice. Okay. Embargo? Yeah. Okay. Yeah, our team is pretty good against grass. I could get rid of, uh... Locked. Okay, we could put Bully away if I wanted to. Um... Uh, let's see hello. I'm gonna grab some potions and stuff, too. We'll check. See what's going on. Like, if I want to prepare for the grass gym, I could put Bully away. But I think having it... T like, we have to pick certain Pokemon for the gym anyway. So it's not like... Not like it really matters. Um, let's grab some Hyper Potions. Let's just grab a bunch of those. Spend some money on those. Okay. Just want to make sure I had those. And we'll see if there's any quests here as, as well. One dude. A cool task? Just listen. Gym Leader Bailey imposed me with the task to count all red and blue flowers in Tropic Jungle. I'm afraid of wild Pokemon. Count all red and blue flowers and tell me the amount, okay? Oh, boy. All right, let's take a peek over the bridge here. All right. Hidden uh... item? Hey, Brina, 48 months. What's going on? I can't get in the house. What's the point of that? Uh, 
Uh, Katie, I just hope everyone's gonna be okay. I'm sorry to hear that. Oh, interesting. Okay, so that's the way to the next town. Uh-oh. Oh, it's Kira. Oh, hey, A-Drive, how are you? Bailey, the gym leader of Green Pines Gym, isn't here. He's in the tropic jungle. The gym said he'd be back soon, so I'm gonna stick around until he gets back. Take this. A board motor. They were on sale in the market. I got you one. It's great for climbing waterfalls. Oh, okay. Thank you, Genesis, for the cheer. How are you? There's a mysterious Pokemon hiding at the waterfall. Oh, this is gonna be cool. We're gonna head into a jungle and there's gonna be a waterfall. That sounds really cool. Thank you, Genesis. How are you? And Brina's got your stream boss. Oh my god, the kids. Hey, talk to me, little one. There's no way you're actually gonna give me an item, are you? No. Didn't think so. Mommy lets me go and play in the jungle. Alright. Let's take a peek here. I like to make sure I check everything, guys. You gotta check everything. I'm buying some of my flutes? Dude, everyone keeps selling me stuff without actually doing this. Without actually telling me how much everything costs. No, I don't want your flutes either. All you people in your flutes, man, get out of here. Okay, so this is the gym. We can't do that yet. Hey, Arcane, thank you for the 20 bits, man. One of the best botanists in the world. Thanks, Arcane, for the 20. Grass type Pokemon, they're weak against bug, yada yada yada. And a miracle seed. I feel like I have three miracle seeds by now. It's crazy. Okay. Let's go this way. Okay, I think we've explored this entire town. So to the jungle we go, I suppose, my friends. Let's do it. Alright, which way do I go? This way. Uh, Genesis, there's no category for the game otherwise. Alright, so Route 15, so new encounter, new opportunities, new potential. Ah, it's a stick it! Dude. Is it time I finally get my stick it, guys? Like, we've been talking about stick it for so long and I never caught one. I think I might have to catch a stick it. <laughs> Alright, Geronimo! He's got a bug ray! Yo, that thing looks sick! Why do I feel like I've seen that thing before? That thing looks so cool. Stick it! Goodbye. Alright, Spyro is gonna get a level there up to 42. Here comes a bug ray. I'm gonna switch though, because I don't know what this thing does and I don't want to risk it. It looks really cool though. Acrobatics. Yeah, we should go for this guy. Speed boost. Ooh, I'm interested. That's an interesting little guy there. Let me guess. I have to headbutt the tree for him. Is that is that how that's gonna work? I don't know, man. Uh, let me hyper potion. Get Spyro healed up. Okay, a max potion. Okay, we've got another encounter here and then a double battle up ahead. Oh, dude, it's this massive plant, homie. Okay. Okay. Big flamethrower here. And almost knocked him out. Swallow, that's a fail. Yeah, this might be a good opportunity to just train Spyro in the grass, to be honest. I'm debating on whether I want to do that or not, but we'll get some good experience here. All right, let's, let's do this double battle. Who's... Second in my party. I guess we can do Terra. Yeah, let's do Terra. We're gonna tropic jungle for our studies. I'll show you what I learned in school. All right, let's do it. All right, Darto and Lunape. Okay, so this isn't looking too good for Spyro. So Spyro's gonna get switched out here. We're gonna go into uh, Terry, I guess. I'm going to do this, and then I'm going to wood hammer and obliterate this Lunape. Yes, Rockhead with wood hammer is looking pretty sweet, right? That's that is, that's really good. We needed that. He's gonna be so powerful. 
I'm loving it. Spider wants to learn Dragon Rush. I hate that it's like not that accurate though. I'll teach it to him, but it's annoying that it's not very accurate. Leaf Tornado. Alright, I think we're good. Air Cutter, yeah. Air Cutter, and then uh, we can just Wood Hammer. Of course I missed, dude. That did nothing. So he's. I thought he was uh, Grass Water, but I think he's Poison. Whatever. Poison Grass. Let's try this again. Now I actually hit it. Good job. Good job, team. Get ready for the next round. Spyro gets another level. And Pateri wants to learn Air Slash. Yeah, buddy. All right, so Air Cutter will do that. Okay. Yeah, Team Earth, again, please stop with any sort of indication of any spoilers, man. I'm going to ask you to stop. Seriously, thank you. It's really frustrating, man. I don't know how many times I have to ask you guys to stop spoiling, and it's the same people. Like, don't do that. I don't want any spoilers at all. I don't want to know anything. Please try to respect that. Thank you. All right, we're going to the Tropic Jungle. Thank you, Loran, for the nine months of love. What's going on, dude? How are you today? Thank you. A dove heart. Oh, I remember this guy. I think it's Fairy Ted. We'll switch. We'll go to Spike. Air Slash. Yeah, Spike is powerful, dude. Dude, I do want to get that bug guy, though. He looks really cool. Big Gyro Ball. This should do a lot. Goodbye. Okay. And Lorant's got your stream boss, too. And here comes another Dove Heart. I'm just going to stay in. That little bit of experience won't make a difference. Let's jar a ball. Oh, it's a male one this time. Amity Wind. Creates a peaceful wind. I wonder what that does. Huh. Interesting. Roost. Oh, I can't use Amity Wind after the... Wait, what? I can't use jar a ball after the... This is crazy, dude. I can't do anything. Oh, his peaceful wind. Can you not attack him It with super effective moves if he uses that move? That's crazy. Hey, Red, thanks for the five bits, man. That's, like, actually kind of nuts, dude. You can't hit him with super effective attacks if he uses Amity Wind. That's kind of nuts. Almost at the jungle. Jungle. That's a long route. Can I handle your bug type Pokemon? Oh, I can. I hope you're ready for my snick. A bug ray. Yeah, this guy's sick, dude. It, it's like they want me to get a bug ray on my team. Okay. Dude, I need to not trust this thing in any sort of battles. <laughs> I need to like not even let him battle ever. I keep thinking, oh yeah, he'll be alright. He's got multi-scale, dude. Yikes. Yikes, dude. Hey, Murph, thanks for the bits, man. Appreciate it, dude. And thanks for understanding about the spoiler thing. It's nothing personal, dude. It's just, you know, it's very rare that I get to experience a game, you know, kind of without knowing anything. So I just prefer that people just don't. You know, if I ask for help or ask for something, then feel free to chime in. But otherwise, just you know, try to keep the comments, like, super spoiler-free. You know, if you want to say something like, Hey, Dan, there's a really cool Pokemon in this route. Keep looking. Or, hey, you know, this thing's got... I don't know. You know what I mean? Like, there's things you can say. Oh, I'm, we're dead. Oh, my gosh. I tried to run, dude. I thought we were dead there. Oh my god. Yo, he eats, dude. He eats. Snack is eating. Eating good tonight, Snack. My goodness. It's okay, T Team Irv. No worries, bro. Spyro to 45. Spyro, I need you to, to be better than you are. <laughs> His defense stat is just so bad, dude. I really hope... I'm in it for the long haul with my man Snack here, so... Multi-scale saving the day, I know. I'm in it for the long haul. Fisherman. A smock. Bruh? You good? You good, bro? 
You okay, Smokwa? You're looking sad, buddy. Submission. Oh, you're fighting type. Alright. You look like fighting in water, so I'm gonna lightning strike your face in. Yeah, that's what I thought. That's what I thought you were thinking. Angelite. Yo, Snack better be so good, Meyer. <laughs> I'm trusting a little Snack here. I feel like I'm basically nursing like my Victini right or my um whatchamacallit right now, my uh my Dratini right now. Dude, I love Woodhammer with Rockhead. I judged it hardcore. And I have no regrets right now. I do wish his type changed a little bit though, but Rockhead makes sense with Rock type. Rock Rock Grass is a good type though. It is a good type. I do have the Eevee Light, yeah, but I'm, I have the Lucky Egg on him right now uh, because I want him to um, to get more experience and catch up to the rest of the team as fast as possible. Is kind of my logic. So yeah, Terra is my starter, which is sick. We still have him, so that's been really clutch. It's a super long route to the jungle. TM facade. Okay, I can work with that. That's not bad. It's something. My birds will beat you. Oh, you've got little birdies, do you now? Okay. Do I dare stay in? I just like can't. I can't bring myself to stay in with Spyro, like under any circumstances. I really want to. I really want to use him and just start flamethrowing things. But uh, it's the struggle, dude. Oh, I should have air coded. That was a mistake. Wrong button. What's up, gentlemen? It is a Nuzlocke, yeah. Alright, let's uh, air cannon here. Another Parabo. Probably survive one attack dang sm I know, we keep saying that, and then we're like one crit away from being really upset so I'm trying to like be careful about it uh correct Meyer yeah we're doing a Nuzlocke but I'm choosing my encounter because it's a fan made game so I don't really know any of these Pokemon so we changed the rules a little bit I'm gonna call it you know everyone get, got mad about it so we're just gonna call it an A-Drop lock and I'm just gonna change the rules and do whatever I want and that's gonna be how it's gonna be so exclamation point seven the chat creeper but yeah, I just choose my encounter. I don't think it's that big of a deal. Like, it's not like I'm sitting here picking the most powerful thing every route. I'm picking what I want. You know what I mean? Like, what I think looks cool. There's been so many times I'm just like, yo, this thing looks cool. Let's catch it. And either I don't even use it or whatever. You know what I mean? So, there's some options. It just depends on, you know, when I see something, I know I like it. I want to use it. Alright, uh, back to Spyro. Spyro is actually pretty much caught up now. But he's just so weak. I need him to, like, evolve or do something. Uh, but Terry's good if he can live a hit right now. Alright, just don't hit yourself in confusion, Pateri. I trust in you. Don't make me have my trust misguided. We're dead. Now we're good. Alright, let's full restore. Back to full. Don't chatter again, though. He chatter again. Yeah, I think from now on when I Nuzlocke, I'm probably going to do that where I pick the Pokemon. I just feel like it's it, it still gives you the challenge of a Nuzlocke, but you get to use the ones that you think look cool. Like, for Sword and Shield, I want to Nuzlocke it, but why use stuff that I don't think looks as cool? You know what I mean? Like, it adds to the enjoyment of the playthrough, in my opinion. Especially if you've never played that particular game before. Like, why not? I think it's a, actually an improvement to the rule. Because... Nuzlocke's were created in a way that allowed people to challenge themselves in a game that they've already played before. So if you've never played a game before, I think it's a better way to do a Nuzlocke by choosing your encounter. I genuinely feel that way. Okay, so anyway, we're done with this route. So let's actually get our encounter here. There's a Stick It, dude. Stick It looks really cool. People are telling me I need to headbutt, though. Um, headbutt those trees. So let's go. Let's, let's fly back. We'll headbutt. And then... Um, and do that, I think, is probably the best play. Uh, look, let's see what else is in the grass, but I think headbutting those trees is probably the best play. People were telling me to go for that bug dude, so that might be the, the option. Yeah, because there's this little monstrop, which we've seen a few times. 
Um, ah, just, just so close to knocking him out, too. Big green. That's a four times resist, baby. We're out here. Okay. Nice little burn. And we can just finish him off with a flamethrower again. Get some good XP. And these guys are easier, easy to knock out, so I'm just kind of knocking them out real quick. All right, let's see if there's anything else here. I'll get another encounter or two. Another one of these dudes, Monstrap here. Good old Monstrap. Nice and flamethrower. Oof. I'll take the XP, though. I'll take it. Headbutt isn't necessary? Oh, okay. Another Parabo. Okay, I'm switching, though. I'm not going to chance this thing wrecking my soul. Crush Claw. That's going to hurt, I think. Eh. Not as much as I thought. Big Lightning Strike. Boom. Spire to 48. Wants to learn Will-O-Wisp. I think I had that as a TM, though. I like Glare, actually, more. <gasps> Spyro's evolving, baby! It's time! Ooh, he's gonna be a more powerful snake. <laughs> a more powerful snake. Big snake! Hey, look at him. Got slith heat. Biggest snake, dude. We got a big snake. Wants to learn will o -Wiz. Wait a minute. I just said no. All right, so we got Big Snake now. Let's see if Big Snake's any better. His defenses are so bad, but his special attack is so decent. I mean, he's not mind blowing by any means. Um, but I'm gonna give him. I'm gonna give him the Evil Light now. So that'll at least help his defenses. So he can he can actually be useful now. Where's the Evil Light? I feel like randomly the bag sorts itself sometimes. I don't know. There we go. Okay, I'm gonna give him the Eviolate. Okay, so I'm being told to headbutt. I'll get the Pokemon I want more. I think we pretty much definitely want um, that other dude for headbutt. So let's let's fly with the service whistle. I want to get that bug. So let's fly back to Green Pine. And let me snag his evolved form for the layout for everyone, uh, which is called a Slith Heat. Interesting. Um, and let's update the layout. The screen's black because I clicked out of the game. So just give me a second. Boom. Right, this guy's cool though. All right. Let's do this and let me just grab a headbutt Pokemon. Um, Bucky! Where's Bucky? Bucky! Bucky, it's time. It's time to come back, Bucky. All right, let's take a peek here. Bucky, you're back. Who believes in Bucky? I believe in Bucky, dude. Use a dead mon to slam its head against the tree. Jeez, Marvin. All right. <laughs> Headbutt time. Let's see if we can find that little bug. There it is. Bug ray it is. All right, so I'm definitely, I'm shining into this thing, dude. I have to. I can't escape. Oh, he's got Twister. Wait, does that, that mean I'm stuck here? Or can I still escape? Okay, I escaped. All right, we have to shiny hunt this thing, dude. So we're gonna pause, we're gonna shiny hunt it, and uh, I'll see you guys on YouTube here shortly after I shiny hunt this thing. To speed it up. Thank you, Zeisty, for the follow as well. If anyone's new, yes, I got it already, dude. Oh my God, that was so fast. <laughs> that was so fast, dude, and he looks incredible. Ah, dude, that was so fast, guys. That was so fast. Turn up in the chat for that. Okay, we have to weaken him without knocking him out here, so. Uh, let's see here. I think the Leaf Seed play. Yo, that thing looks so good, dude. He's gonna U-turn. That's super effective. Alright, that's fine. And he's got speed boost, dude. That's so sick. Okay, uh... Alright, we're going to... Go for the Z Leaf Seed. 
Alright. Let's, uh, let's do that. And he's going to U-turn again. That's fine. We're bulkier now. Leech Seed. And get a little health back. Weaken him a little bit. And throw that Ultra Ball. Start chucking some Ultra Balls at him. Okay. Come on, stay in the ball, buddy. That, that was really effective. Acrobatics. This might actually hurt a lot. Okay, it didn't. <laughs> uh, it didn't hurt as much as I thought it was going to. Okay, that's fine. Dude, this thing's sick. Is this the first shiny bug we've gotten? I don't know. Nice! Speed boost, dude. I love it. And it's bug flying. It swarms humans who wander into the jungles, leaving bites where they remain itchy even after days. Repels specifically made to counter them are commodities in the tropics. Okay, what do I name it, guys? Give me some sweet names. Bug Ray, dude. What do I name him? Her. What do I name her? Chat. Cybug. Bugs McGee. <laughs> Hmm. Sparks? Dude, I kind of like that. Let's do that. We got Spyro. Sparks. Alright, let's go. We gotta go to our PC, like, immediately and go check it out. Please don't spoil Strike. Yo, guys, Striker and anyone else, please don't spoil the game for me. Thank you. I feel like I have to say that so many times, guys. Please stop. Thank you. Let's take a look at him. Organized boxes. He came over here. Speed boosting. We have actually got some full full boxes here. All right, we gotta make a decision now. Cause this guy looks pretty cool. Right, let's take a look. Is he any good? Serious nature. He's actually really weak though. He's super duper weak. He's got Twister, U-turn, Swagger, and Acrobatics. I'm being told to add him to the team. I'm being told to add him to the squad. So, I don't know, man. Let me get a screenshot of him here, and uh, we'll throw him into the uh, into the Photoshops here real quick. Yeah, I definitely want to add him to the team. It's no doubt about it. Um, we got to decide what we're going to get rid of, though, to put this homie on the team. Because that's going to be tough. Like, how do I even decide who I'm going to get rid of right now? All right, let me crop this dude. Make a sprite for him. Save it as a PNG file in Solar Light and Lunar Dark. Okay. Um. Hmm. Yeah, does Spectre finally go, dude? I don't know, man. All right, so let's let's do one thing at a time here. All right, so let's put you back on the team. Sorry, Bucky, you're just here to headbutt things. Do I possibly get rid of Spectre right now for this homie? I don't know, man. Sparks, dude. Do I get rid of Spectre? Oh my god, this is crazy. Okay, well. This is crazy, but we're doing it. I can't believe I just did that. But uh, we're doing it. And Bug Ray is added to the team. So... Show some love, guys. Hit that like button down below for Bug Ray. And sorry, Spectre, but Bug Ray's been added to the squad for now. And we'll kind of see how that works. Uh, whether that's going to be a good thing or a bad thing or who knows what. But um, I'll give it the, um, I'll give it the, whatchamacallit, the, the lucky egg, I guess. And we will go from there, guys. So that's going to be the end of this episode, guys. I hope you enjoyed it. Hit that like button if you did. Subscribe if you guys are new. And I'll catch you guys on the next one. Peace.